Welcome back, part two. So if you have AT&T speed internet, this is what you must do. Go to advanced. Then you want to go to connection configuration. And all this other stuff should pop up telling you all this and that. And I do not support universe plug and play. You're not going to change anything but this. On your home page, you should see two things at the bottom. Private IP address and public IP address. I am using a private IP address, which is basically using an IP address that my internet service provider is recommending me using. So I'm going to use a public IP address that my modem can just give me off the back. Take notes for um, any other users who do not have AT&T. Uh, you may have this same problem, so I would do this to see if it works. And uh, if it doesn't, then I really can't help you. I really recommend you calling your internet service provider. Let's go to yes, public IP. I was using pop. I was using private. Now I'm using public. Save changes. And I'm going to restart my modem. It should take like 30 seconds. I'm sorry about the quality, this is the only way I can um, get the video on YouTube. The next video I upload will be in high quality and um, straight from my chip, so it won't show none of this, all this other shit. Now that it's done, just let me connect back to the internet. Oh, and um, if you do do this, um, you will notice that your internet will be kind of slower. And uh, if you want to watch like videos on YouTube, it would go slow. Like it would, you know, play through and then stop, play through and stop. So let's wait till the page uh, loads up, and then I'm gonna show the final part, and that's part three. As you notice, my computer is moving slow now since I use public IP address. 